Hello, my name is Andy Johnson. I'm an employee at RV in beautiful Duluth, Minnesota. Today I'd like to spend a little bit of time with you and do a short video of our 2015 Grand Design Solitude. And this is a model 369RL. We'll walk around the outside of this fifth wheel. We'll show you the inside and we'll see what you think. Back off a little bit. It's got your nice big power awning. LED lights and awning lights up your whole campsite. Got outside speakers. Let's move in on this outside storage. There's a magnet that holds this door up. Slam latch baggage doors, just like a motorhome. Huge amounts of outside storage. Two 30 pound propane tanks that we fill up for you. There's six, six automatic hydraulic leveling jacks. Just push a button. Real aerodynamic front cap. It's got the trail air suspension up here so there's an inch of rubber right in between just to give you a better ride. You can plug a solar panel right into this spot here to charge your battery. Lots of storage up front as well. LED light up front. I'll back up just so you can get a better shot of this cap. We've got three slides on this fifth wheel. Nice bedroom slide. Here's your second 30 pound propane tank. Here's the back side of that storage. Here's all your utilities. And this is a one piece, so this, usually there's just silicone sealing this off, but this is one piece just like a shower. So if you get a leak in here, it goes right out the bottom, no problem. That was your water filter, and you got your outside shower here. Okay, a lot of fifth wheel companies, what they'll do is they'll just put a door that only opens up so high. Grand Design takes the time to split this door so one can go up and out of your way. Then you got another one right here. And then you've got your automatic leveling jacks. All you have to do is turn it on hit auto level, and it takes it from there. Detachable power cord. There's, so there's a set of automatic jacks in front of the suspension and behind the suspension to really make it nice and solid inside. Cracked track system. You got the aluminum rims, nitrogen filled tires, eight lug rims. Frameless windows. Rear bumper, it's pre-wired for a backup camera up there. Got your ladder going up. Here's that third slide. If you've watched my videos before, you know that I'm in love with aluminum steps. So I take one finger, fold them up, out of the way. Nice feature, try doing that with steel steps. Then you've got an LED light underneath those steps to help you get back from the campfire. Nice big grab handle on this 369RL. Okay, so you're searching the world trying to figure out the right fifth wheel for you. Well, if you're going to pick this one, it could be just because of a little thing called a dishwasher. So just wanted you to see that stainless steel dishwasher in the island. Solid surface countertops, you got the undermount sink, pull out faucet. Nice big sink. And you've got the big gas electric refrigerator in stainless. Tons of outside, or tons of storage. More solid surface countertops. And it's got bull floor linoleum. Nice thing about bull floor linoleum, it's made in Belgium and it does not crack in the cold weather climates. Lots of storage. You got your oven. Nice residential size microwave. And then everybody's favorite. A huge pantry. Nice pull-outs. Okay, we'll keep working our way into the living room. Okay, so we've got a fireplace, electric fireplace. You go somewhere and you have free power, you now have free heat. Next thing I want to do is pull this out. Nice to have a spot to keep all the letters or bills. Okay, you've got a nice TV already on board. AM, FM, CD player right here. Then you've got your ultra leather couch in the back, does go into a bed. Storage up above it. AC right here, and that's ducted AC throughout. Then you've got your recliners. Storage up above them. Nice table and chairs. Large windows. Chairs lift up. Nice spot for silverware right in the table. 
Okay, as we go up the stairs. Nice hanging closet by the door. Controls right above it. Okay, so one thing I want you to think about. You get up at 2 o'clock in the morning. A lot of campers, what happens is you have to walk down these steps in the middle of the night to get by this door that swings out. But since this is a pocket door, you don't have to walk down those steps to get into the restroom in the middle of the night. So just kind of a neat idea. Uh, porcelain toilet, lots of knee room. Tons of storage. This is deep. Then you've got your shower. You've got the seat for shaving those legs. Skylight for those tall guys. Nice residential fixtures. Okay, then we've got our vessel sink. Nice thing about this sink is you got lots of lots of countertop space for all those toothbrushes, all those things. Then you got your medicine cabinet right there. And we'll work our way back and in to the master bedroom. Okay, neat things about this room. Huge king size bed. Nice storage, nice seat right here. You wake up in the morning, you want to get a little blood in your head. You can sit on that. You can reach to your dresser from there. Nice spot right here for uh, jewelry. Then you got a nice uh, lockbox down there for a handgun or some money. Okay, then we've got our three windows. Nice window up above for anybody that's a little bit claustrophobic. And then we've got second AC. And we'll just go right in this closet. LED lights in here. Lots of storage. Plenty of room for Mel DeMarcos' shoes. And then you've got your dryer vent over on this side so you can put a dryer over there. Then I'll just turn around so you can see that you've got your washer dryer. It's pretty dark in here, but just so you know, there's a washer dryer hookup right there. Nice big dresser. Second AC is right here. And a nice big TV as well. So we'll just walk right down by the fireplace. We'll walk past that beautiful dishwasher. And we'll just do our big ending right at the fireplace. Well, my name is Andy Johnson. I'm at Bullion RV in beautiful Duluth, Minnesota. If you're interested in this 2015 Grand Design fifth wheel, just call or text me at 218-391-ANDY. Thanks for watching this video. I hope it was helpful. And as always, keep on traveling.